Well, Assistant Commissioner of Police Hewlin Hanna pointed out that saturation patrols are having an impact on curbing crime, but he says it's no cause for residents to become lax. In as much as there, there are patrols all over New Providence, that you must be mindful of where you are at every material time and that you must try to make sure, to ensure that you and your loved ones are safely taken care of. It has been our experience that there are planned criminal activities and then there are those opportunistic criminal offenses. Opportunistic offenses are of concern, and Mr. Hanna admitted that this time of year, certain crimes spike. As you move about this Christmas, you're going to see us attempting to blanket the areas. We not only want to focus on the mega stores and the mega shopping areas, but you know the mom and pop stores make a significant contribution to the economic well-being and stability of this country and the New Providence in particular. And so you're going to see us in some of those very densely populated areas, some of those areas where people may not necessarily want to see the police because they may feel as if the police are there to disrupt their nefarious trades. But be that as it may, you're going to see us, and this is a deliberate act on our part. Now, Mr. Hanna said since the firearms tracing unit has been activated, well in excess of 150 guns and thousands of bullets have been taken off the streets.